The president is facing new questions about his interactions with Attorney General Jeff Sessions. According to the New York Times, the president asked the attorney general last year to reverse his decision to recuse himself from the Russia investigation. On CBS This Morning, Congressman Trey flat, Gowdy please. was asked if that request was actually made, would it constitute obstruction of justice? I, I don't think so. I think what the president is doing is expressing frustration that Attorney General Sessions should have shared these reasons for recusal before he took the job, not afterward. Um, if I were the president and I picked someone to be the, the country's chief law enforcement officer and they told me later, oh, by the way, I'm not going to be able to participate in the most important case in the office, I would be frustrated too. That's how I read that is, is Senator Sessions why didn't you tell me this before I picked you? There are lots of really good lawyers in the country. Mm -hmm. He could have picked someone else. Yeah. With more on the president's response to this, we want to bring in CBS News Chief White House Correspondent Major Garrett from the White House. So, Major, what has been the president's response to this? Well, either the president was watching or he was given Trey Gowdy's comments. Either way, he quoted Trey Gowdy verbatim on the president's own Twitter feed, Real Donald Trump. And then added the words, and I wish I did, meaning I wish I'd pick someone else as attorney general. The president has implied that before, but he's never so publicly declared his regrets as he did this morning. Of course, it's always been open for the president to fire Jeff Sessions. He hasn't done that. Sessions could resign. He threatened to do so last year, but was talked out of it. So the uneasy piece continues. The president airing his frustrations publicly. Session soldiering on under a cloud, and that's where things stand. Hmm. So the reporting is that Robert Mueller is interested in this allegation mm -hmm. that the president asked uh, Jeff Sessions to reverse his decision. What would Robert Mueller be looking for? So the Mueller team is in, interested in several interactions between the president and Jeff Sessions, direct and those on Twitter, where the president has qu criticized Sessions. What the Mueller team wants to know is was the president using either the power of his office, the power of his rhetoric, the power of his Twitter feed, if you can believe it, to exert pressure on Jeff Sessions to do anything to hamper or slow down or redirect the Russia investigation. Now, the president's attorneys, some still on the case, some no longer on the case, have told me, look, the president has very broad powers under Article 2 in the Constitution. He can talk to his attorney general about anything. And if he did so, it doesn't necessarily mean he was trying to obstruct justice. Rudy Giuliani told the New York Times yesterday, Rudy Giuliani is a new attorney for the president, that he could have just meant make sure the Russia investigation stays on track. We don't know what the president meant, but the Mueller team wants to find out. And that's one of the areas it's grown more interested in in the last couple of months. What are these interactions? What were their context? What did the president mean? and get his own assessment of that. If there is, ever is an interview between the two, Mueller and the president, this will be one, Bo, but not the only area of inquiry for the Mueller team. So 